Hello everyone, it's Eva with Polished After 60. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So guys, in today's video, I thought that I would share some recent purchases um, that I've made um, to add to my autumn and fall wardrobe. So if you think you'd be interested, please stay tuned. I'll be right back. Alrighty, everyone. Welcome. Welcome back to my channel. I hope that uh, everyone has had a wonderful summer. We're, uh, we're into September. I just can't believe that, uh, that this year has just flown by so quickly. Pretty soon we'll be uh, getting ready for Halloween, Thanksgiving, and then of course the holiday season. So, um, it's going to be a busy time of the year. But um, as I had indicated in, in my intro, I am going to be showing you all some recent purchases that I've made. Now, a lot of the stores are having pre-season sales and end-of-season sales, and these are stores that, um, that I purchase from occasionally. So I thought that I would share some items with you. Now, in these items that I'm going to be showing are uh, actually from I think all of them are from either Banana Republic Factory or Amazon and I'm going to be sharing them with you and what I thought that I would do is you guys know that um, I'm here in Florida so I still have a lot of summer left it will be hot here until October or November but I do like to uh, keep my eyes on uh, the season that we're in and update my closet as I need to. And that's what I've done here. Now I went through a few weeks ago and did an overhaul of my closet. I was able to give away a, a lot of items that I wasn't using anymore. So I just thought, right, I get rid of some and add some. Isn't that the way that we women are? sometimes. Um, and if you have a shopping addiction like I do, well then um, I can always make excuses for myself. But I did want to share with you um, some sandals that I'm wearing. Let me take them off because I think they're so cute. These are these Vince Camuto sandals that I recently purchased from HSN. They had a Vince Camuto today's special value or whatever they call it and uh, they have free shipping on anything that you purchased. I purchased a couple of belts that I'm waiting for. These sandals for myself, I purchased the same sandals in gold for my mom. So I'm gonna take them to her uh, next week, but I, I still see that they have a lot of um, end of the season things that we can purchase. These shoes were almost $100 and I got them for $29 plus free shipping. So it was a great deal for me. And I am always looking for ways to stretch my budget. I like everyone else have a limited amount of funds that are available to me. And I do purchase some things uh, beginning of the season, uh, normally in the fall and then in the springtime. So fall things that I can wear into the winter. Now remember guys, winters for me are very different than they are for uh, people that truly experience the four seasons of the year. So I buy at the beginning of fall and then I take that into the winter time and if I purchase um, smartly, I can use them year round. I do the same thing in the spring, things that I can wear in the spring, carry them on to the summertime and hopefully be able to use some of the items um, year round as well. So let me just go ahead and back up so that you can see my outfit of the day. I think I've shown this to you before. I love these um, pants. Uh, they're Bell by, by Kim Gravel, I think. Um, QVC, the shoes of course are Vince Camuto and I got this t-shirt in tapas. Guys, um, I'm having a little bit of an issue with YouTube is um, 
dinging me uh, for things. I shared with you the link for this t-shirt from Talbot's and I had a problem with the with the uh, the the video that I produced for you guys. So I'm not sure if I'm going to and Talbot's is a reputable store. We all know that so I'm not sure why um, why they put a little strike against me but I hate to break rules and that was a little bit disappointing. Anyway, I'm going on and on and on, and you guys want to see um, what I have here on the bed. Now, I will say that I think what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to show you these items in today's video. And what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be doing like a series, and I will add the items that I purchased into my existing closet, so things that I have in my wardrobe now, and show you how you can add new things in with your old things and breathe new life into your closet. So when you purchase things, ladies, always think in um, use three as your magic number. You want to make sure that you're purchasing things that will go with existing items in your closet, at least three different outfits. Hopefully you can use them more than that. And if you choose a palette for yourself or um, some colors that you're gonna be using in the upcoming season, whatever season that might be, then you can kind of coordinate your things with each other and with things in your closet to make a nice varied um, style or lookbook for yourself, all right? So let me go ahead, let me put this down. I've got my glasses on because I want to be able to see. And let me go ahead and come over here and pull some items for you. Now guys, I am in the habit of, if I find something that I like, I tend to buy multiples. Um, I know that some of you do the same, but it's, it's a good idea for myself because, um, I like the way they fit, I, I like the way the items look, and then I can use them interchangeably in my closet, all right? So the first thing that I wanted to show you all, and all of these items with the exception of two things are from Banana Republic, but these are these cute Tencel joggers and they're in a cargo style, which we're seeing a lot of. I like the fit of them because they don't balloon out. It's a nice slim cut, so it looks nice on the body, and you can wear these casually or you can dress them up a little bit. So I thought that for my casual look, which is really, that's usually what I wear most of the time, but there are times when we do need to dress up, right? So I got these um, at a great price. I think I paid $28. I got them in black, and I also got them in this pretty olive color. They might still be on sale, ladies. I will just link the Banana Republic factory outlet um, website in my description box and then you can go in and if any of these items are things that you might be interested in then you can go and see if they're still having a sale some items are up to 70 percent off and that is a great value so if you're looking for things to add to your wardrobe guys these things are not sponsored the majority of my um, videos are not sponsored in any way. They are things that I purchased for myself. And on the occasions where I am gifted items, a lot of times what I do is I, I gift those items. I pay those items forward, all right? So I just wanted to let you know how, I, how my channel exists. So if, in case you're wondering, and I don't make, I don't make enough, I don't make anything pennies from YouTube. So I want you to know that as well. I did this on the Lark during uh, the pandemic. It was a way for me to share with other ladies. And so here I am a few years into this process, but I do it for the fun of it and to spend a little bit of time with you all. I hope you know how much I appreciate all of you and that you're watching and spending time with me. So what I did was I bought five bottoms. So I have the two joggers, Excuse me for reaching. I thought I had this better um, organized. And then wide legs are back in style. 
I see that a lot of classic items are on trend. Now, I don't go for the trends, but I do like to update my closet so that I don't look so um, stuck in the past, right? But I did not own a pair of these wide leg trousers. So I, again, I purchased two. One in this cream color, which I will be able to use that year round, guys. And then I purchased them in black as well, a staple in our closets that we can interchange and use throughout the year, not only in the fall, but throughout the year. The next item I purchased was from Banana Republic as well, faux leather and leather is very much on trend. I already owned a pair of faux um, leather slacks, so I thought I would update my closet with this lovely it's so pretty it has pocket details and buttons down the front it has a seam um, right at the hip area a little bit lower actually around mid thigh and it is a midi length I was able to get it in a petite size so the length fits me well the only thing is trying to get the creases out of this I was steam pressing these items yesterday and they don't look like I've done anything. So I really have to work a little bit harder before I show them in a lookbook for you. But again, a classic, classic piece that we can wear year after year, season after season, all right? So this is from Banana Republic as well. I think I paid maybe between 50 and $60 for this item. Let me see if I can see the regular price of this. This was priced $120. So I got it for a very good bargain. Okay, so those are five bottoms that I purchased that I will be able to use throughout the year possibly and throughout the fall and into the winter. Now I, have, I also have um, some denim that will round out the bottom. So I have a lot of denim, uh, different types of jeans. We're seeing denim in all different fashion. Uh, skinny, it might be a little bit outdated, but I still have them and I know that I will still wear them. Straight leg jeans, boot cut jeans, which I adore. I think they do wonders for our figures as well as flare and wide leg. So I think I have um, at least one pair in all of those styles. So I will be able to um, wear them casually and then a little bit more formally by adding a blazer. Ladies, if you don't have blazers in your collection, I would urge you if it's appropriate for you to think about getting a nice um, tailored blazer for yourself because you will be able to up, up date and make any um, look in your closet more elevated by adding a jacket or a blazer, all right? And then the next things that I have are some tops and a third piece, all right? And one dress, which I'm still thinking about. Okay, as I said, I buy in multiples. They had these, I think they're called Timeless Tea long sleeve. I wish they would have had them in a v-neck, but I don't like mind a crew neck. So I bought two of them, one in black, one in cream, and I can use these interchangeably with jeans, with the trousers that I showed, the joggers, I can wear them as well. So this is an item, or these two items, I will get a lot of use out of in my closet. I purchased one blouse. Those are also from Banana Republic. Um, this blouse is regularly um, $70 and it's like a silk or satin type blouse. Can you believe that I tried to press this yesterday? They had this top in a variety of colors. Actually, I think all the colors that are in this pattern, they had as solids, but I wanted to add some kind of print um, to my closet, all right? I didn't wanna add something in a solid color because I have a lot of different solids in my closet and I wanted to add a little bit of pattern. And I can use these with those cream colored slacks. I can use these with the black trousers. I can use these with jeans. Um, it's long enough that I could wear them 
uh, wear it with a legging if I chose to. And so again, I will get a lot, the black leather skirt with this look beautiful. So a lot of different options for me. Think three, you wanna be able to use all your items with existing pieces in your closet with three different outfits. I got one third piece and this is a faux leather topper or moto jacket, if you will. I think this item also came in black. I do have a black vest already. Vests are very much on trend, but for me, it's more about the third piece because these are the types of completer pieces that we need in our closet to make us look a little bit more pulled together whenever we're going out, all right? So this is the third piece for me. Um, $140 is the original price. I know I didn't pay more than $50 for this. I don't think I did. So it's a good time to go on to the Banana Republic factory if you like their clothing. Um, pretty decently priced and very nice quality. Um, so I urge you to go onto their website and see if they still have some existing sales for you. And then the last item I got was a dress. Um, it's running a little bit big on me, so I think I'm gonna have to change it. It is a shirt dress, um, a satin or silk inspired dress. It buttons down all the way down to the floor. It does have a little bit of a split on either side. Very classic look. You can belt this. I think I can also use that other blouse and put it on top of it as a topper. I could almost make it look like a silk um, skirt and top together. I know I'm going to get a lot of use out of this. I could put a pretty blazer over it. So a lot of different ways. And this is a nice, smart looking dress that is timeless and elegant for us, right? Um, I know that there is a lot of discussion about, I hate this term, guys. I'm going to say it only because it's what's trending now. This old money thing that's going on. I hate that term. I don't know what it means. I don't like the, what it, the, I don't like it. It, um, puts people at different levels and I don't like that. So the only reason I'm saying that is because I prefer to think of that as more of a classic style. I am more of a classic style um, aesthetic with a little bit of boho thrown in, all right? So I look at things and pieces that are classic in their styling that I can use year after year, right? So I hope you enjoyed the items that I'm showing you. I'm not gonna show them in, I'm not gonna wear them today because I wanna show you how I implement them into my existing closet, which is what we should all be doing, right? Use the things that you have, buy a few items, and then add to the overall wardrobe, your overall style. All right, so that's what I'm gonna be doing before I go away, and I hope that some of you are hanging on to the end. I wanted to say that this is a lovely community, right? A community of women that we all share with one another, encourage one another in good times and in bad times. And there are some of us, um, creators that are experiencing some difficult times, ladies. Um, in particular, right now, I'm thinking of Melissa55. Um, you may know her channel. She is a lovely, lovely woman, and you might know that she is going through um, breast cancer. So guys, Think about that. If you have a minute to go onto her channel, go on and give her a boost, encourage her. And Sheila, I can't remember her channel name. I will try to find it and link it below. She also was um, dealing with ovarian cancer. And guys, let's all encourage us, encourage each other through the good times and through the bad, because I think this is a beautiful community of women who love one another, encourage each other, 
and um, just go on to their channel and show them a little bit of love if, if you have a moment, guys, because that's what life is all about, right? It's about encouraging those around us and trying to make their days just a little bit better. Okay, this is a long um, video. I didn't intend for it to be so long, but um, I hope you guys stuck to the end. If you're not um, a subscriber, please consider subscribing to my channel and have a wonderful day, everyone. I will see you again real soon with some additional um, books for you. All right, have a good day. Bye, maybe bye. Bye.